Our motoring tip of the week concerns alignment intervals. Now, one of our viewers wrote an email and he's got a one-year-old uh, vehicle and he's just rolled 20,000 K on it, took it into the dealership for the 20 K servicing. And they were suggesting a wheel alignment. Uh, and he's kind of balking at that because he says his tire wear is perfect. Uh, the car doesn't pull, doesn't vibrate, no symptoms. So he's thinking maybe I don't need to do that. So this is one of these deals where, you know, there's certainly a lot of things where you can make a case for doing a wheel alignment. Everything that he's described to us though points to the fact that this car probably doesn't need a wheel alignment. However, without taking the actual readings or me looking at the car, can we say definitively that it doesn't? No, we can't. So the proper way to, to do it then would be to, to check the wheel alignment. Now, everything he said pointed in the direction of not needing it. But at one year and 20,000 K, it's due for a tire rotation. And that's the case with uh, our cameraman's car here today, Pete's Versa. Uh, we put new WRG3 all-weather tires on it a year ago. They haven't been rotated yet, so it's due for a rotation. Now, I did ball joints in this car a year and a half ago. It had an alignment then. There was a dealer recall where it got brand new springs under, under the uh, recall campaign. Had another wheel alignment then. So the, we know the alignment's in good shape in this car. But on a front wheel drive car like this, the, the wear ratio uh, front versus rear is almost two to one. In other words, it'll wear the front tires at almost double the rate of the rears. So if you're not rotating them on a regular basis, you'll end up with erratic tire wear just because you didn't rotate. Another case that you can make for doing a regular wheel alignment is that there's steel bolts in the suspension, big long ones, at least that long and sometimes longer, that pass through steel sleeves in the suspension components. If they're not moved every once in a while, and there's eccentrics on either end, cams that rotate them around in an elliptical uh, pattern. If you don't move those cams periodically and they sit in one place for years and years, you'll never move them. They'll weld up solid with rust. So doing a wheel alignment once in a while, which moves them around, pays off in the long run. You can make a case for both sides of this story, but once a year or every 20,000 K is certainly not unacceptable, but very minimum, do that tire rotation. That's your motoring tip of the week.